to send balanced vibrations to the family, to the tribe. I just had to come on now and do it live because it was on my heart. And I'm speaking, I'm doing this for myself. And being known that we all self and all is one, I'm doing it for all of my reflections because it has to resonate, you know, in, in some way, shape, or form. And so, what I was dealing with for the past umpteen, you know, days, months, weeks, uh, who's gonna keep the count, is perfection. You know, wanting to do the things perfect, you know, and then doing, then trying to do things perfect, perfect, delayed the, put this light on it, and, you know, this for the family, so. You know, want to do it perfect, and wanting to do it perfect, it delayed the manifestation of it. You know, because I'm trying to you know get it right, tie a bow around it, or this thing, get it, or now I don't have this product, or this this type of lighting, or this type of phone, or this angle, or this camera, or this this all this other stuff. You know, and this stuff, of course, I had to order it and buy it, and and. Being the in in the in the my finances wouldn't allow at the time, or in and so it kept delaying me in what I wanted to do, and that trickled down into many other things. And again, this this is raw, you know, from my heart to yours. And I had to stop it, and it had to be stopped with actions, and it has to be consistent, you know. For example, I did a a, a twenty two day you know exercise regimen. Where, and again, with this 22 days, I think I did 23 days. And I didn't start the 22 days. I did like six and then stopped and lost track. And then I got back on for like 14 and lost it again. And I was like, God damn it, I got to keep going no matter what. Just do it wherever you are. And, and I did it for 23 days. Knocked it out smooth. Proving to myself that I can be consistent. I can do it. And then I dropped it again. Completely erasing what I mean, and I proved it to myself. I did it physically, and I did it. But then I dropped it. So defeating the purpose of me actually even getting to it and, and wanting to do it consistently—that was the whole purpose. And when I put 22 days on it, I put a cap on it. So my next one would definitely be a 22 and beyond, you know, um, workout campaign for myself, you know, and. Wanting to do it perfectly, again, delayed it being manifested. Knowing that, um, <laughs> this is a one on one, for real, for real. And, um, knowing that, get my mind again, lost my train of thought. <laughs> Thinking too much. Again, it has to be in the know, it has to be pure, and you have to entertain yourself for, my, for me. Again, I have to actively do it and it goes through the growing pains you know it might it's, it's going to be hard <laughs> it's going to be tough you know the, as the, the the flower breaks through concrete you know it didn't happen like that it took you know a substantial so amount of time and effort to to grow to this height you know to this place and i thought about it again we're doing um i posted a video today and that video, again, trying to break out of the cycle of waiting for the perfect thing to be done. You know, waiting for the perfect angle to be done. Waiting for the perfect day, the perfect sunlight, the perfect time. And, and just, just do it because I'm building the consistency. And one of the things that built, that launched that trajectory in, in this video and sparked it was a video from my brother, Seven Beaumont. Well, I'm talking to family, so brother Seven. And long-term mentor, you know, to most of us as we grow and expand within this dimension and beautiful reflection of what is possible you know uh, stretching the mind releasing the monkey mind changing the body from the inside out and reflecting uh, our manifestations with a slew of products and technologies that far are far and beyond what is seen on a daily day basis day to day basis and, this, and we have a tribe full of amazing people who are doing just that video I posted ran straight into one of his old videos, the the 2010 video on uh, water, or oh, it's, oh, it's in the water, that's the title, the title of what it was, and in this video, he had the old microphone, uh, uh, old jumpsuit, and um, and he was just, just discussing of his passion for water, and, and <clears throat> what he, what he was working on, and how to program water, 
and you know all in doing his thing basically and but the frame of the video was he was out of the frame some of it had his old microphone he had um, uh, it, it would, you can just tell because we're in the tribe now that where he's come you know seen the progression because I've seen some stuff but it's way too many videos to actually catch up you know on on from then to now there's been hundreds <laughs> of videos so seeing that video gave me a real a starting point I'm starting point because I know he didn't start in 2010 but from then to now seeing the the growth in between reminded me that I have to start somewhere you know it won't be perfect it's it, the intentions have to be there you know I think we mentioned that in the last call or something like that the intentions have to be there you know it ain't about you know the, the camera angles and all psh, the intentions you know once that's done in there and you your the pure pure intentions will reverberate you know as you can build this consistency because what you focus on grows but if you you know get a get a plant you know pour put it in the plant pot it you know get the soil right water it for every day for two weeks and then you stop for a month that seed is gonna have a hard time growing or it might you may have to start over you know with the consistency because you you drop the ball you know so that motivated me to continue to do what I do and just talking about it this right here is nothing you know I'm just sharing the reflection about my of how I'm feeling at the moment and it has to be actions it has to be actions tomorrow I gotta do it I gotta do it and I always found that within myself the, the every time that I was I was balancing the Trinity it was I've been in a in a phenomenal place you know when I mind body and spirit you know when I've been like reading learning things new hence the university uh, as well as so many other things to expand upon uh, the body working out consistently and the spirit you know, meditating and doing what it needs to be to to engage your spirit and anytime I was doing those three things synonymously you can hang it up you can forget it and I, I was shining and that 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 is you know my variables for my success and I'm sure it is for many of you um, and actions it has to be done it has to be done there's no way around it trust me I've tried <laughs> there's no you can't do two and then well for myself couldn't do two and in fact expect things to flow as it would flow when I was knocking out with three you know keeping the balance of the Trinity and you have to get started and you know, it might not look as beautiful as you imagine it to be the first time you do it but check out the 73rd time that you do it you know what I mean and and make and just do it consistently so from my soul to you from spirit tech to spirit tech ambassador to ambassador supreme being of the cosmos to supreme being of the cosmos this is my this is me diary of the day not even diary of the day cuz that sound diary my frequency to your frequency raw uncut i love you keep balancing Keep vibing high at top speeds. Wholeness. Wholeness and balanced vibrations. If you enjoyed this message and found it to be motivating and you like to keep the momentum going, check out some of the links down below. You can even join me in our Sovereignty Mentorship Program or get some amazing metaphysical adornments by connecting to us on our website and more. Thanks for listening. Wholeness.